The American Physical Therapy Association (APTA) is a US-based individual membership professional organization representing more than 100,000 member physical therapists, physical therapist assistants, and students of physical therapy. The nonprofit association, based in Alexandria, Virginia, seeks to improve the health and quality of life of individuals in society by advancing physical therapist practice, education, and research, and by increasing the awareness and understanding of physical therapy's role in the nation's health care system. APTA annually holds two large conferences and publishes the the Physical Therapy Journal, the leading international journal for research in physical therapy and related fields, and PT in Motion, a professional issues magazine providing legislative, health care, human interest, and association news. APTA also advocates on behalf of the profession and for issues which impact the health and well being of society, such as funding for health health research and for an adequate health care workforce. It lobbies for health care reform to improve access to health care. History APTA originally formed in 1921 as the American Women's Physical Therapeutic Association. The association was first led by President Mary McMillan, and an executive committee of elected officers governed the association, which included 274 charter members. In 1922, the association changed its name to the American Physiotherapy Association, and men were admitted. Membership grew to just under 1,000 in the late 1930s, with the advent of World War II and a nationwide polio epidemic during the 1940s and 1950s, physical therapists were in greater demand. The association's membership swelled to 8,000, and the number of physical therapy education programs across the U.S. increased from 16 to 39. During the mid-1940s, the association adopted its current name, hired a full-time staff, and opened its first national office in New York City. A House of Delegates representing chapter members was established to set policies. The House elected a board of directors, previously the Executive Committee, to manage the association. In addition, sections were created to promote and develop specific objectives of the profession. Among the early sections were schools now the education section and self-employed now the private practice section in the 1960s APTA membership reached 15,000 and the number of education programs nationwide grew to 52 Currently 242 institutions offer physical therapy education programs and 364 institutions offer physical therapist assistant education programs in the United States. These numbers will change significantly in the coming years to encompass 17 developing PT programs and 18 developing PTA programs. Topic. Combined sections meeting In 1976, the association launched an annual combined sections meeting, informally known as CSM, that is attended by physical therapists from around the United States. It's so named because all of the sections of APTA meet at this time. Topic. 
previous and future CSM meetings. Topic chapters and sections APTA has chapters in most U.S. states as well as sections covering special interests. Sections are, Acute Care Aquatic Physical Therapy Cardiovascular and Pulmonary Clinical Electrophysiology and Wound Management Education Federal Physical Therapy Geriatrics Academy of Hand and Upper Extremity Physical Therapy Health Policy and Administration Home Health Neurology Oncology Orthopedic Pediatrics Private Practice Research Sports Physical Therapy Therapy Women's Health Topic see also Physical Therapy Journal of Orthopedic and Sports Physical Therapy Journal of Neurologic Physical Therapy Journal of Physiotherapy Chartered Society of Physiotherapy United Kingdom